I don't come here to take life seriously. I don't come here to take the internet seriously. The internet is one big joke and it's one big meme that we have to conquer. We were placed behind these monitors, behind these blue screens. We got addicted to these devices, but in the midst of becoming addicted to these devices, a lot of people are suffering from being cyber bullied. A lot of people are suffering from taking things too serious, getting triggered by a comment, getting triggered by what somebody else says when the internet is just for laughter. It's for motivational, inspiring, trolling purposes only. <laughs> I've seen Charleston White said, he don't come to the internet to make friends. He just come to say his opinions and talk nonsense. Talk, and that's, that's a smart way of using the internet. How are you using the internet to better your life? Are you still caring what other people say? So you care about what other people say in real life and the internet? It sucks to be you. Man, I do these videos to inspire, to share information, and also just to get out there in the forums, get out there in the public. Stop being a consumer and start being a creator. A lot of us are trollers. I don't mind the trollers because everybody has a job. On the internet, there's infinite jobs, but the internet is not a real place. What's real is what you believe. So if you put your belief into comments, videos, content online, then your reality could be skewed and you won't know from what's real and what's from what's false. See, we could share our truth. We could share a truth. We can't come to consensus on a truth because what you count as a credible source of inter information, somebody else doesn't. These people, there's some people who have to read certain things by certain scientists, a certain white college graduate for it to be real. And we don't entertain those because everyone has the right to say how they feel to say what's true for them, but you could only use your discernment and right of intuition to see what's really real. The internet is not a real place. So stop acting like it's a church. Stop acting like it's a court. You go on the internet nowadays, there's somebody debating about relationships, where to travel next. Did you hear what he see, he, she say? It's always some debate always something to drain your energy because the people know that we're spending countless hours on our devices on our laptops you know you pick up your phone to read i hope you don't read the ebooks you retain more information when you pick up physical copies otherwise other way when you pick up and read on your phone whether it be the fake new york times some other liberal news some other mainstream media that you count as a credible source and you share that misinformation to other, everyone, that's how people come along with disagreements, debates. You don't know that that person you're arguing, arguing with is a CIA agent. You don't know that person you're arguing with is sent, has a job to confuse the public, to fight for a certain agenda. I've seen Lil Nas X on an interview, casually saying how he was talking about how he was thanking the, the gay agenda at the VMAs and the interviewer asked him about it. And he was jokingly, half jokingly saying how, you know, we go to these meetings and you want to go to the world, dom we want to get world domination, we draw a star. And we're trying to lower the world's population because the world is overpopulated, which you know is bullcrap. But there's some truth into that. And that's why the internet is a fun place for those with the eyes have to see. Some people will take that serious, like that's, how could you do that? You're a sellout. How could you do that? How could you do that? Why would you sell out? Why would you want to do that? That's just a terrible thing. Why would you want to make everybody be attracted to each other so we won't world produce? But that's just part of the internet, man. We're all actors. If somebody else has the courage to act out their character, don't blame them. Don't get mad at them. Don't hate the player, hate the game. 
attack the system don't attack the character and a lot of people have to be on the same page with one another which i don't understand we don't have to agree with each other we don't have to like what other people have to say every time and if you're like one of those people that says something more about you you can't have a conversation without somebody agreeing with you you have to find that middle ground when that middle ground comes from compromise from both ends when we're here to live our full potential we're here to live our full potential voice our truths and while we do so in the process this comes at an expense this comes at the expense of people coming at you and that's the beauty of the internet the beauty of the internet is where we can express ourselves but you have to have the skin you have to have the shell to voice your opinion to voice your truths because there are people who on here all they do is just comment they I, I think they have like search engine where they put up like trigger words so if it's read in a comment or if it's read in a title they go to that video and just type a long ass comment i know from doing youtube videos most people don't spend their time watching the whole video you could tell from their comments from the comments some people read some people comment on some people some people comment they leave i could tell they didn't watch the whole video because they're asking questions that i answered in the video they're saying other truths they're saying other things that i don't re represent that i don't say they come to their own conclusions based on what the three minutes they heard so i come to realize that the internet people are just here to talk to fill the space with noise to fill the space with their comment they're not here to be intellectual they're here to be entertainment they're here to be a troller they're here to just consume and probably spit back what they want you to believe so when you do this internet stuff this social media stuff don't take it too serious you have to prepare yourself for what what's to come the trolls the haters the popularity the growth the ups and the downs see this internet stuff is fun we living in a great age but only people with the eyes are able to see it so when you're on this internet stuff don't take things too serious and lose use your discernment when you come across pages articles and always look past the surface what's the purpose of this article why are so many people publishing this article at once <gasps> excuse me but don't get caught up in the gossip the drama the separation the internet is here to distract you only if you let it it's also here to inform you and it's also here to get you rich so why are you using the internet comment down below and if you enjoyed this video like share comment subscribe and until next time you guys be well